friends and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thank you for stopping by. In today's video, I am going to be going inside Big Lots today to see what they have to offer for the spring season this year. So let's go shopping. Today, we will be visiting two Big Lots stores, and as you can see, Big Lots is not short on any of their signs, whether they're for outdoor use or indoor use. So let's take a closer look. As you can see, gnomes are here to stay. They have entered into the spring season. This topiary was adorable but quite pricey, considering you can find something similar at the Target Bullseye spot for only $5. This floor mat here was absolutely stunning in person. I love the pastel colors of the tulips. The price was right, but honestly, these types of core mats, they do shed a lot. So I'm debating whether I should get it or not. <laughs> a nice size however you can find something similar at your local Dollar Tree for only $3. Now, aren't these little peeps so adorable in these pastel rainbow colors and, of course, the traditional yellow and they were so cuddly and soft. Now, isn't Miss Bunny all decked out for the spring and Easter season in her beautiful spring dress and her lovely basket full of eggs? I like her, and she was made out of good quality. As you can see, the thick texture of this fabric. I like this little Easter tray, and I felt that it would be an easy DIY. <music> Big Lots had a nice selection of outdoor signs as well. And I thought that this bunny here was absolutely adorable and would make for a great outdoor display. Quite a few of 
right here on this aisle are repeats from last year. I really like this floor arrangement here and I'm gonna come back to that one in a minute. And a lot of these Easter trees and topiaries are repeats from last year as well. I thought these little green topiary bunnies were adorable and they seem to be much smaller than they were last year. Now back to this floor arrangement. I really like the color palette that was used with the white tulips and I like the textures as well. How beautiful for the spring season. Now these wreaths here were separate from all the other wreaths that I showed you earlier, but I really love those tulips on top. Look at the vibrant colors, and I thought the price was a great price for this wreath. Check out these adorable mugs. I actually found these on the checkout aisle on my way out the store. I like the soft pastel greens, pinks, and yellows. I also like the little speckling that was on each, and on the rim of each mug was the words hop, 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 and they were quite large in size, and they had a good weight to each of them. at store number two and this Easter basket caught my eye. How fabulous is this one? This would make a great gift for that special little princess in your home. <laughs> Now this wreath is similar in color and texture as the floor arrangement that I showed you in store number one. If you're leaning toward a more neutralized spring and Easter decor, this would be a great starting point for you. Store number two had a better layout with all their seasonal decor. It was more organized and categorized based upon similarities with colors and patterns. Lighting is important to your decor as well. So if you're looking to jazz up your deck or outdoor space, these lights would be so adorable. I want to thank you all for stopping by my channel today. It has been so much fun shopping with you guys, and I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up, and please share this video with everyone that you know that enjoys shopping and decorating their home for the spring and Easter season. Until the next video, happy decorating. Bye, guys.